Aloha, welcome to today's live stream. My name is Master Paul, and I am honored to be with you here today. I am actually in Master Shaw's Tao Healing Center here in Honolulu, Hawaii. And today is Wednesday the 30th of November. We're almost into the holiday season of Christmas. And along these holiday times, I tend to notice that a lot of people uh, have high levels of of uh, emotions occurring, I guess the best way to put it. And those emotions range from fear to negativity to anger to abandonment and all of the layers in between. There is depression, there are some anxieties. <clears throat> There's quite a range of emotions that occur during the holiday times. And uh, today, we're gonna be focusing on one more aspect of a series that I'm working on this entire week. The series is on negativity and how we allow it in our life. And this is about reversing negativity. Yesterday, I did a live stream on self-worth and how we degradate ourselves by lowering our own values and self-worth. Today is about negative self-talk. And so I encourage you to stay the entire hour. If you cannot, know that this is recorded and you can come to my Facebook page and look at it in the future. <clears throat> Today, I will be offering a demonstration. It'll be a remote demonstration to one of the lucky ones in the viewing audience that through divine guidance, I uh, recognize as someone that has a great deal of negative self-talk. So as uh, people enroll, I had uh, 13 people today ask to be Facebook friends. Uh, I thought that was very unique given the nature of the subject of negativity in our life. In other words, when I did the advertising prior to today, I just sent out a simple video saying, hey, this is what I'm focusing on. <clears throat> 13 people who I've never met before but discovered <clears throat> this, uh, this activity through Facebook and Facebook groups have said, I want to know more about this. So it goes to show me just how many people are, are, are suffering with negativity in their life. And it comes at us from many different directions. Uh, one of them is our own self-worth values, our own loathing. One of them is from, uh, I'm gonna talk about tomorrow, is fear of abandonment and the need for approval. How does that relate to negativity? It puts us in a weak place. It keeps us in a place where we are not positive about the outlook in our life and we are not positive about moving forward. And so all of these uh, uh, seemingly individual separate emotions or conditions all lead to negative aspects in our life. So we're gonna be covering those as well. So I wanna uh, take a moment and pause and welcome everybody. So welcome Michelle Melton, welcome Elizabeth, welcome John Robert Coleman, good to see you JC. Um, GR, excuse me. Uh, Eleanor, great to see you as well, Shari. And Zach, uh, second day, thanks for coming in. Kathy Berger, CJ, welcome, coming in from the uh, Philippines, I believe. And welcome Pat, Petra, coming in from live from Europe at one in the morning. Welcome Nancy, welcome, um, Amy and Olivia, great to see all of you. I truly appreciate your daily presence and I hope that these services are serving you. This last uh, half hour, almost the last hour, I have been working on um, what can I do? What can I, how can I serve you? Because as divine channels, that's, that's our life. We are here to make sure that you can move forward on your soul journey with the least restrictions as possible. And negativity tends to uh, inhibit us from moving forward in so many areas of our life. If we have negativity in our life, hard to do your job well, hard to earn your income. If we have negativity in our life, hard to be a good parent, hard to be a good husband, wife, uh, or significant other. And as a divine channel, we, we're always looking at ways. How can we assist you with clearing the Shen, Qi, and Jing blockages that, that continually roil up in our life? They're just like boiling water. It's always coming up. What can I do to assist you? So I, I um, have developed uh, three different divine services that I'm very excited about <clears throat> that'll give you a, a layer of options that, um, that could 
could be something very, very valuable for you as a self-Christmas gift uh, and possibly for a loved one. I'm going to talk about that a little bit more as, as we move into today. I am going to do a, a demonstration later today. <clears throat> so um, you all get to tell me why you deserve to be the one to be the demo by telling me how bad is your negative self-talk. Um, and then I will check divine guidance and if, if, if uh, divine guidance is that you are the one that needs this the most, uh, then you'll be the blessed one that receives the demonstration. So welcome Akara, welcome Stephanie. So let us start by connecting heart to heart and soul to soul by placing our hands in soul light, soul service, hand position. And we're going to uh, drop the left palm in front of the heart center. The right palm remains pointed towards heaven. Wherever you're at, at home or wherever you're at, place your feet flat on the floor. Take a deep breath in and release. Some of you are finishing your day and you're just unwinding a bit. Some of you are beginning your day like in India and this is uh, your starting off point. So just release and take a deep breath down. Close your eyes. Place your mind in that little dip in your back directly across from your belly button. That's called the Mingman acupuncture point. Bring your mind there. This will help you to remain focused. <clears throat> and so when you keep your mind in this lower part of your abdomen, the lower part of your back, it allows your mind not to wander. Let us connect. Dear Divine, dear the Tao, dear the Source, all layers of all committees, up to original creator. We love you, honor you, appreciate you. We invite you to join us here today. To the soul of Master Shaw's Tao Healing Temple, the countless holy beings that are present. I love you, honor you, respect you. I bow down to you. I ask you to please, as appropriate, be present today to offer whatever blessings are most necessary. I'm very, very grateful. Thank you. Dear the soul of our individual heavens teams, guides, angels, and saints, the soul of all those that are, have come on the line today, we love you, honor you, respect you, and we thank you for your presence. We ask you to please guide each of the individual souls here today <clears throat> that they might receive the highest wisdom, guidance, and blessings that is most appropriate for them and their negativity that shows up in their life in all the different ways that it shows. Thank you. To the soul of all of the negative mindsets, negative attitudes, negative beliefs, negative self-talk, anything in the form of lack of self-worth, anything in the form of abandonment concerns or fear of loss of somebody near us, fear of not being enough, the need for approval from outside of us, any of these types of emotions and conditions. We ask you to please be present so that you can transform and leave all of us forever, as appropriate. To the soul of love, peace, and harmony, source soul song transmitted to all souls in all universes, we love you, honor you, respect you. We ask you to please turn on. And we invite all souls to chant with us at this time to serve unconditionally with this source soul song. So let us all chant together. If you're not familiar with the song, please keep your eyes closed and just receive the blessings. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, li. Lula, Lula, li, lula. Wo ai wo xin he ling. Wo ai tren ren li. Wo ang li hing rong he mu shi shang. Song ai ping an he xie. Song ai ping an he xie. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, 
and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. La, lu, la, li, with a smile on your face. La, lu, la, la, li. La, lu, la, li, lu, la. Lu, la, ha, li, lu, la. Lu, la, ha, li, lu, la. Oh, I wash in her ling. Oh, I trun ran lay. Wong li ying rung her mu shi shang. Song I ping on her she. Song I ping on her she. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Ha, ha, ha. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The Source Soul Song of Love, Peace, and Harmony has been given to Mother Earth. The, the uh, trademarks and all of the associated copyrights have been removed. It has been translated into 50 languages, and you can learn more about it and chant it to serve yourself and others by going to lovepeaceharmony.org. O -R -G. <coughs> so um, let me acknowledge the others who have come to join us. Welcome Richard Amodio from Thailand. Welcome Kristen Strachan from Colorado. Welcome Lori Chapman from Mexico. Welcome Nancy. Welcome Malina Love. Thanks for coming in again today. Welcome Bart coming in from Europe and Carol. Halina Yakman and Sylvia. Welcome. And then uh, Jermaine. Sincere Jermaine. I like the name. Welcome Chelsea um, and Olivia. Wonderful to see you. Welcome Donna Bawana and Teresa Brown Ford from Kentucky. So whoever else I have not mentioned, it's because I haven't seen your name pop up, uh, Master Shah would teach us, uh, you're not mentioned, more virtue. So my name is Paul Fletcher. I am a worldwide representative of Dr. and Master Zhigang Shah. Anything that you ever hear come out of my mouth is something that is copied. It is wisdom, learnings, teachings, and blessings that I have been blessed to receive from this uh, amazing spiritual teacher and spiritual father. Um, for those of you not familiar with him, uh, Dr. and Master Zhi Gong Sha, very quickly, is a world-renowned healer, well over 100,000 documented healing miracles. He teaches love and peace and harmony. He teaches us how to heal ourselves. He has well over 20 books, 10 of which have reached New York Times bestsellers, four of which reached number one. So my encouragement, if you're, if you're not familiar with them, to go learn a little bit more. Um, today I'll be uh, giving each of us a blessing from this book, Tao Song Tao Dance. Today I will also do a what's called a divine flow, which is a message from heaven on the specific subject of, of um, negativity, specifically self-talk negativity. And today also I will be offering a, um, a very special divine service. And a divine service is literally a blessing from the divine through a vessel like myself for a, um, a lucky recipient. In the room, I'm at Master Shah's Tao Healing Temple here in Honolulu. And in the room, uh, one of the students who has been coming for a few years now, <coughs> uh, his name is Patrick Sr. And uh, he has, has experienced uh, literally several. It would take a half hour for him to explain all of the blessings he has received from Dr. and Master Shah that has literally saved his life at least three times. Um, uh, and I might ask him to share like a five minute version of one of them if we have enough time so that you know his experience. His third eye has opened because of the, um, the blessings that happen at, at healing centers like this. And uh, he'll be sharing with you the value of remote healing. I'm going to offer a remote crown chakra blessing to one lucky recipient. And he'll do a, a reading for that for the third eye. So I'm going to ask all of those uh, that have not already hit the share button to please do so. And then um, I'm going to do first a flow. And I'm going to ask heaven or uh, whatever soul wants to speak 
<clears throat> what is the nature of negative self-talk? What's its origin? What's its purpose? What's its value to us, if there is a value? And how it can serve us by becoming aware of it. Also, uh, any additional information that I have not requested that's of value for us to know. When we have heaven's information on a subject matter such as negativity or negative self-talk, we can learn a lot. Uh, heaven has such great wisdom to share with us when we're able to tune in. From there, <clears throat> I will uh, check what your guys' comments are. So I'm going to ask for those of you who truly have negative self-talk to uh, type in now, please choose me because I have negative self-talk on the level of 0 to 10, 10 being you're almost ready to drive yourself crazy, 0 being eh, just a little. Um, then I'll check the mind guidance and choose one of you to be a recipient of this blessing. Okay. So now I'm going to do a flow. <coughs> on the nature of negative self-talk. So dear the soul of negative self-talk, dear heaven, dear divine down source, dear the soul of any of the holy beings that wish to come at this time to offer a teaching on this, would you please come and borrow my mouth? So right away Kuan Yin came. So let me tune into her and see what she has to say. <coughs> This is Kuan Yin. I have come because I witness this very unfortunate form of self-deprecating communication with so many souls. I can tell you that through the blessings my beloved Creator has given me, that I have saved countless, countless people's lives who are in desperate places ready to take their life because of this most treacherous condition. Many think that it is something that is outside of them, that it is like voices in their head. And in fact, in many cases, it is. The one you know of as Dr. and Master Shah brings a teaching. That teaching is of spiritual debt and spiritual virtue. In the Buddhist traditions, it is called karma. In the mainstream Christian or Catholic traditions, it is called sowing and reaping. In every, quote, religion, there is a name that represents imbalances of our communication with each other. Those that suffer greatly from negative self-talk have very likely been on the victimizing side of the coin. They have very likely been the one saying very unpleasant negative things to others. And so in this lifetime, they hear a lot of unpleasant and negative things in their head. In some I cannot turn it off is a common statement I hear. What is the creator of these but the karma? How does one release themselves of this very treacherous spiritual debt? It must be released through the greatest of love the greatest of compassion for those souls that were on the receiving end much as you are now. The reason I have come to deliver this message is because had it come from most any other soul, it might not be necessarily believable that souls outside of you could cause such great suffering. Yes, about 30 or so percent is self-accepted 
negativity taught to you or given to you by your parents, peers, teachers, brothers, sisters, lovers, and more. These self-accepted ones have to do with your lack of self-worth and you have chosen to believe it as truth. Both serve to give you an opportunity for transformation. This is the message that I bring so that you understand what is the source. As far as the solution, love and compassion, especially for those that have been on the receiving end of such an unpleasant experience. When you are in a place of this depth of suffering, find yourself uh, to be present and say, Dear all of the souls that I have ever spoken negatively to, that I have caused to self-talk negatively to themselves as a result of my ego pushing you down, I deeply and sincerely apologize. This is what is meant by compassion. Let them know that you have felt the level of suffering that they must have experienced and you sincerely ask their forgiveness. From this place and with consistency, you may uplift yourself out of the horrific depth of suffering that can occur with this level of self-negativity. Additionally, you may use the, the Tao light blessings that was offered yesterday and will be offered again today. Because with divine frequency, with Tao frequency, you can transform all blockages. This is the message that I have for you. It is with my greatest heart of love my greatest depths of compassion that I will be there for each of you in each moment you call for me and in some where you do not to help all of you uplift your soul journey and return to the heart of our Creator. This is Kuan Yin. So I bow my head nine times to Kuan Yin. Thank you Kuan Yin. Thank you for this message. Countless bow downs, countless bow downs, countless bow downs. <clears throat> so thank you for that message and thank you for all of all of those who have just tuned in. I uh, want to acknowledge anybody else who just came in this last few minutes. Uh, Crystal Valencia, welcome. Kristen Rojas, welcome. Davorka and daughter, welcome. Yvonne and Zico and Anita Johnson. So for those that have just tuned in, uh, you can make a request. I will be offering a blessing for those who have the highest, uh, most pertinent need to remove negative um, self-talk. Uh, shortly, tell me what your level is, zero to 10. 10 being, uh, if it doesn't stop, I'm gonna, I'm gonna really hurt myself. Uh, zero being, yeah, not much. Don't lie, heaven knows. Um, but uh, do let me know if it's a significant issue in your life and then I will check heaven's guidance to see who will receive this blessing. Now in the meantime, I'm going to offer something where we can heal ourselves, okay? Um, yesterday, for those that tuned in for the, the, um, this session on uh, self-worth and self-worth issues. <clears throat> self-worth and self-worth issues are other levels of negativity that come into our life. And in order to, as, as beloved Kuan Yin said, in order to clear these blockages, we have to use a frequency that's higher than our own. Because of these benevolent souls that our beloved Creator has brought to the planet, uh, uh, many, many benevolent souls. We have, of course, before the Jesus and the Buddhas and Mother Marys, and we have all these amazing beings from around the planet. And in current time, we have the Dalai Lama, we have other benevolent souls. Master Shah is one of those uh, 
blessed souls that has been given authorities and powers to transmit healing, to clear Shen Qi Jing blockages, which are soul, heart, mind, energy, matter blockages. Or another word of saying that is negative karma, um, spiritual debt. He has the unique authorities to clear those. Um, as he served humanity over the last 15, 20 years, he has been given higher levels of abilities and authorities, including the ability to transmit healing power and um, healing objects, if you will, into things like books. So there's a reason why this master has 20 books and 10 New York Times bestsellers. Uh, it's not accidental. The books have power in them, and all you have to do is do a little research, and you'll find out that it's true that the power works. And so yesterday I transmitted to everybody who is ready to receive what's called the uh, uh, Tao Soul Mind and Body Healing uh, Jindan. So I am going to offer this again today uh, as a worldwide representative and uh, divine channel. Uh, I have been given the authority to transmit what, what he has put the power in the book. Um, individually, if you have this book, you cannot transmit it to anybody else. Whoever has this book, they can read it, they can receive it, that's fine. But only a worldwide representative can transmit it to somebody else, okay? So don't make that error. So for those interested, this is the Tao Song Tao Dance book. After we receive this, we're going to practice with it, uh, or I'll teach you that practice in a little while, but we're going to do a demonstration next. And then I'm going to go ahead and read through who who's, feels that they have uh, some significant conditions around uh, negative self-talk. So this is what's called a Tao Golden Light Ball and Golden Liquid Spring of Tao Light. So Tao Light is, 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 Tao is everything, Tao is source. So that's a far superior higher frequency than human light. I can say the word light, 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 light as a human and it's only so big. Heaven's light is much bigger than my light. Earth's light is much bigger than my light. Obviously Tao's light is substantially bigger. And by bigger, I mean a much higher healing frequency. So when we receive this treasure, if you choose to receive it, then it is not something just for this moment. It is a treasure you can turn around and turn it on because it it's literally becomes a part of your soul and it travels with your soul forever. It is called a transmission. Uh, if you've ever read any of the ancient books, you read about some of the masters where the student follows the master for 20 years and at the end he transmits all his power to that student. This is along those lines. That's who Master Shah is. He is able to transmit uh, power into objects and things. And so I will be transmitting this from his book to you. I'm just the middleman. I'm not doing it. I'm uh, being a middleman to transmit it to you. But this light ball, if you want to know if it works, of course you're going to use it for yourself today. But I challenge you to turn on this Tao light ball and go use it for your children or your husband or your pet. Chant for 10 or 15 minutes, Tao light blesses my pet, Tao light blesses my children's toothache, whatever it is. You chant for 10 or 15 minutes, I would be shocked if there wasn't a dramatically significant noticeable difference. That's the power of a higher frequency. So if you don't understand it, just practice with it, okay? You'll get a Master Shah book. Page 200. For those that are ready to receive, close your eyes, sit up straight, put your feet flat on the ground, rest your palms on your lower abdomen, relax your shoulders, bring your back away from the back of the chair. Very important to bring your back away from the back of the chair. If it's not in pain, this allows the frequency to run through you. For those that are not ready to receive, just tell the divine out loud or in your head, uh, thank you, but I'm not interested in receiving at this time, okay? Prepare to receive. For those with their third eye open or um, with the ability to feel energy, feel free to report whatever you experience. Now order, I'm, I'm Patrick Sr., please, I'm gonna ask you to, to tell people what you see uh, in just a minute. So. The gentleman I told you in the room will also do a third eye reading with this transmission. This is not the healing. This is just something complimentary to everybody on the line. Tao order. Just a moment. Dear Master Shah, dear Divine Tao Source, I'm honored to be your worldwide representative. Um, as uh, being given the authority to offer this, your order through your book. Thank you. Tao golden light ball, Tao golden liquid spring of Tao light. 
soul, mind, body transplants. To everybody watching right now, everybody who watches this video in the future, anybody who received this yesterday or before will receive a boost as appropriate. Prepare. Transmission. Join as one. Hey, yeah, yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, yo. How, how, how? So, Patrick Sr., can you come up for a moment? Explain to people what you saw. What I saw was the, in the beginning of the invocation, heaven's clouds started swirling around in the sky. Then when you started doing the transmission, the clouds parted and a beam of golden light came down. And I could see individual souls where golden balls started swirling and get, getting bigger with the transmission. Thank you. Thank you, Patrick. Thank you very much for your sharing. So Patrick will be coming up in a little while to also describe what happens for somebody when they receive a, uh, I'm going to do a crown chakra blessing in a little while. So now I'm going to go through, <clears throat> oh good, I see somebody commenting they saw a golden pillar. Um, Akara says, Akara is one of our students here in Honolulu, she has that amazing third eye. Uh, I saw a golden pillar of light come through the crown of her head and enter into the heart center to fill her body with golden light and to clear away blockages. Thank you for your sharing, Akara. It's always great to have several people with their third eye sharing. It makes a big difference. Okay, so now I'm reading through everybody's um, statement as to where they're at on their um, level of discomfort. Give me a minute, I'm still checking. So for those that um, are interested in individual soul communication where I do flows for you individually, you can contact me. Um, individually through my website. Okay. Okay, so um, the person that Heaven says most needs this is Melina Love. And uh, there was definitely, uh, definitely some <laughs> There's about five people in the running, but I have to go through and check one by one by one. So, congratulations, Melina. And so, what we're going to do is what's called a crown chakra blessing. Now, uh, I'm going to give a, a little description first before I offer this in terms of what it is. And then uh, I'll do a soul reading, uh, which is very very valuable. It helps to understand what is the source, what is the original reason of why we have these blockages in our life. It's always karmic related, but it's good to have an Akashic Record soul reading to find out why. And so I'll ask the leader of the Akashic Records to open uh, Melina's Akashic Record and we're going to discover, uh, Melina, I need your permission 
to read your Akashic record um, because it may reveal some things that you might feel is a little bit embarrassing. I try to be careful with my verbiage, but it's important not to take it necessarily personally. You're, one of the things is, is I have killed people in past lives. Okay, I have done some very unpleasant things, but guess what? So have we all. And so I can't let that stop me from being a better soul today. I know I am not a killer today. I am not any of those things that I could have been in the past. But if I have any suffering today, it's because of what I have done in the past. And so um, it's important to, to have an open heart and to understand that in order to move forward, we have to take responsibility for the choices we made. If we're suffering, that means we've caused that suffering upon others. That means we take responsibility. That doesn't mean we go into our ego and say, oh, I don't know, I don't want people to think bad about me, because that has nothing to do with you moving forward in your growth. So I will need your permissions, Melina. Let me know that that's okay. And then uh, I'll go ahead and uh, do a soul reading if that's okay. <clears throat> okay, I see that she's giving me permission. So I'm gonna do a soul reading first. Uh, regarding the nature of this and then uh, actually just prior to that I'm going to do an explanation of what this blessing is. <clears throat> so there are three different blessings that are available to everybody that is watching this video. Um, first of all you just received a Tao Light Jindan. You heard two people with third eye uh, tell you that they saw a shaft of light go through their body, heart chakra opened up. You have something that a billion saints in heaven do not have. You have a Tao light ball in your body, and it can heal. It can heal aspects of your life. It can heal people outside of you. So how do you turn it on? How do you use it? Dear the Tao light ball I've received, I love you. Please bless me to clear negative self-talk. This is called self-healing. And then you just chant, Tao light, Tao light, Tao light clears my negative self-talk. Um, we'll be practicing with that throughout the week as we did yesterday. I'm going to focus a little more today on another level of blessings and it's called Divine Services and I created three of them. When I do this, I ask Heaven, I say, Dear Heaven, how can I serve these, these, these souls with the negativity that impacts their life so much that they're not able to move forward? And uh, I receive some very generous pieces of information. So. There is what's called the healing and transmission system, which is the highest level of healing. The next level is the crown chakra blessing. And then another level, which is about equal, uh, will utilize two things. Um, now, uh, the healing and transmission system has three aspects to it. The, it includes um, brand new energy and matter, and all of the energy and matter that's been holding on to the negative self-talk, negative self-love, whatever that is, whatever that shen changing blockages are, they gotta go. New energy and matter comes in. In this case, it would be for the heart center. Then the second uh, aspect of this blessing is called the divine order for light wall protection. When that darkness is removed, uh, a light wall literally goes around the heart center. Now, this is not just, just cute little words. I just don't see, I'm thinking about a light wall and it's there. Anybody with a third eye can see that literally a light wall is formed. And high level third eyes can see like heavens, generals, and soldiers around this area. Literally that darkness cannot return. Okay, so this is not hocus pocus stuff, real stuff. Um, so that's called the healing and transmission system. That's the highest level of blessing recommended for anybody that has significant issues in their life. Emotional issues, mental issues, very, very good for uh, long-standing pain and suffering, physical pain, very good for any of those. Uh, there are quite a few on the line that have received that and have had, had remarkable results in their life. The next level, which was gonna work for a lot of people, is called a crown chakra blessing and that's what you're gonna witness today. And that's when I ask uh, the divine to please use the channel that I've received to bring divine's light through their body, literally clearing the blockages related to the request. Um, there's going to be three types of requests. Today we're focusing on the releasing of, of self-talk, negative self-talk. However, there is another blessing, and I'm gonna post this. I literally just created a, um, an image of all the three blessings, so when we are done, I will post this in the, in the um, 
messaging chat section and you can see everything again, okay? Uh, but it will include, one of the crown chakra blessings is for releasing blockages to self-worth and increasing uh, your own self-worth and self-value. Another one is releasing negativity, it's negative self, uh, mindsets, attitudes, and beliefs, and increasing positivity. And another one will be releasing fear of abandonment and um, uh, and need for approval, releasing fear of abandonment and need for approval, and, um, and uh, receiving trust and confidence. So these are not small crown chakra blessings, and those will be available. This is one of them. And then the third level is those same three items, but it will be for a brand new uh, transmission that I received at this last retreat. Now there was 350 people at this last retreat, and um, 33 people qualified to receive this transmission. Only 12 actually received it. So in the entire world, there are 12 people that have this um, blessing that I received and it's called a love heart diamond jindan diamond di no, diamond love heart jindan diamond love heart jindan so it's it's like a it's like a Buddha's like a Buddha's heart of love and I received that jindan which is a light ball jindan means light ball so I received like a Buddha's heart of Buddha love which love melts all blockages and so I will use that and I'll also use a calligraphy I received from Master Shah. You see a calligraphy behind me here. Um, one of a kind calligraphy, it's called Opening the Heart and Soul. I've only used it once so far on this show in the last five months. It's very, very powerful. And I will use that in combination with the Diamond Heart Jindan for a blessing, okay? So those are the three services. So we're gonna do a demonstration now. So Melina, I'm gonna call your soul in, uh, Patrick. If you would please come over at this time, I'm going to ask you to do a live reading of what you see when I offer the blessing. So make sure you're in the picture here. Okay. So I'm going to call Marina's soul. Give me a moment. Marina or Malina? Malina. Okay. To the soul of Melina Love, even if her last name is not the same as what's listed here, the person that is on this Facebook page, please come. What do you see when I call her soul, Patrick? Her soul is starting to appear. It's surrounded by golden light. Okay. I'm going to start preparing. Tell them what you're seeing while I'm preparing. There is, there is a gathering of souls. Kuan Yin is appearing, slowly appearing, coming into view. Master Shah is above her, and they're extending their palms outward towards your hand. Prepare to receive, Melina. Please sit up straight with your back away from the back of the chair. Rest your palms on your lower abdomen. Melina, pay attention to your level of, um, of negativity. What you've given in level nine, pay attention to your emotional body, uh, how you're feeling in general, and then we're gonna check in with you in a little while. Tian Wai Tian, divine order. Tian Wai Tian, Crown Chakra Blessing for Melina Love for releasing negative self-talk and transforming it into positivity in all cases as appropriate. Crown Chakra Blessing for Melina. Begin. There is a golden mist appearing from heaven, coming through the palms of Kuan Yin and Master Shaw. It's entering through Muni's crown chakra. It's going down all the way to her Jung level. 
as it passes her heart, there is a binding of thorns around her heart. This healing cannot begin until there's an opening of the heart and Kuan Yin is sending self-love and compassion to her heart. The heart, the binding has split open. Heaven's generals are coming down to help release all the bad karma from the in gray mist from her head and from her heart. Her Jung area, there's a big golden ball and it's growing, growing bigger and starting to twirl. And her heart has really opened up real wide. Around her heart, Heaven's generals and soldiers had created a golden wall that is now being protected protecting her heart. Her mind has cleared and there's a constant flow now through her five elements, blessing her. Master Shah is sending beams of light to her heart through her crown chakra. Thank you. Blessing will continue. Hey, uh, hey, uh, hey, uh, hey, uh, hey, oh. Akashic records are being rewritten, clearing the self uh, thoughts that are written, the bad karma, and being blessed, and self hurt ego is being cleared, and the pages are being wiped clean, and there's new writing being done in Akashic records. How? Ha uh, ha! Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Divine, thank you, Dao, thank you, Source, thank you, Master Shah, thank you, Patrick, for your third eye readings. Let's all give Patrick a big hand. Thank you, Patrick. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I have Kara, if you're still with us, love to hear about your third eye readings. Uh, Melina, please report any experiences you might have had. Uh, I'm going to offer a. Uh, a flow uh, message from um, Yen Wan Ye, leader of the Akashic Records, uh, to have him share what transpired here today. This is actually Kuan Yin wants to talk. My beloved Malina. You are very blessed on this day. I came because I love you. I wanted you to experience the balance that you at one time had. You closed your heart in many ways because you had been taken advantage of again and again and yet again. You are such a beautiful soul, but one that simply did not understand why and how somebody could be so mean when all you were looking for was love. This has caused you to have, as was shown, barbed wire around your heart. This blessing released many lifetimes, a significant one in which there was slavery of those days, 
And there was a great deal of control of the masses through degrading communication. This karma had been following you for quite a while and now there is a great opportunity for you to come up for air and breathe once again with far greater clarity and understanding. This was not a small blessing. There was approximately 225,000 Shen Qi and Jing, dark soul blockages, that were released with this blessing. And it has actually been life-saving for you, as had it not occurred today. There is a possibility that you may have made an unpleasant choice for the duration of how long you would remain on this earth. There is a reason why heaven chose you, and it is because your heart. Please align yourself with the wisdom teachings of this one known as Master Shah, for he cares not that you do as much as he cares for your soul and its journey. This is your beloved Kuan Yin. How, how, how. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, thank you, Marina, for Melina, for um, being the demonstration. I'm fast forwarding here to see if we have any comments from you regarding this. She's crying, <laughs> energy all through her body. Wonderful, wonderful. And I want to say thank you for all the souls who are saying congratulations to Melina because what that shows is a gratitude heart, one that, that says, I'm grateful that she is receiving it versus what about me? And that grateful heart is healing in and of itself. That grateful heart says, I trust that the divine made the highest and best choice. So this kind of a blessing literally has saved, uh, let me check how many lifetimes. Yeah, there would have been about 27 more lifetimes of suffering of this nature had a blessing of this level not occurred. I am not doing it. It's an it's a, it's a exceedingly high level blessing that comes through a what's called a divine channel. I am one of over 130 divine channels on the planet that have received these kinds of authorities. I, I can talk for three hours trying to convince you of the efficacy of something like this, but it, it, it just depends on you and your level of trust. Uh, having offered these kinds of blessings for, for many different things, including addictions and, and high levels of pain, and having witnessed um, very fast uh, shifts, I'm completely comfortable and confident with what divine services can do for anybody. So my encouragement is to use the tools that Master Shah has brought to us. I know that not all of us have uh, financial flexibility now and Christmas and many other things. So you may or may not be able to take advantage of the divine services. Um, that's why I, I've delivered to you the Tao light ball uh, so that you can self heal. You can go to Dr. Shaw, uh, excuse me, tv.drshaw.com. That's a free healing site. You can go to any of Master Shaw's YouTube videos. Lots of complimentary blessings there. You just gotta push go a couple times. So there's a tremendous amount of blessings that are available as much as possible, and they move us forward incrementally. But if you're really in a need where you want to move things through faster, be it any form of discomfort, suffering level, pain, relationship blockage, financial blockage, whatever it is, then you want to take a look at what's called the divine services. So to, to complete those parts of it, there are three levels and three packages. The first level is the healing and transmission system. So you might want to write this down because although I'll post this, um, in, it'll be all written in a nice pretty little uh, JPEG image in just a little bit. It's important to kind of write it down. So the healing and transmission system uh, includes, uh, this, is, this is one higher than what she just received. It includes the removal of the Shen Xi Jing blockages, brand new energy and matter. In this case, it would be for the heart center because that's where a lot of the negativity resides and a light wall protection. This stays with you for all lifetimes. So that stuff just cannot come back. The honor fee for that is $300. 
The crown chakra blessing, which you just witnessed, is an honor fee of $100. And then the additional blessing, which is separate, uh, I talked about a combination blessing. That's using the Love Diamond Heart Jindan, which I'm one of 12 people on the planet who has received it, and the uh, Open Heart and Soul Calligraphy, an extraordinary, powerful healing uh, tool. A combination of those in which I would be offering a blessing um, uh, as appropriate. And that is a normal honor fee of 100, I'm bringing that down to 75. 300, 175, okay? Now the package, there's two packages. Okay, so those are individual. Package one is all three of them. The Jin Don system, the crown chakra blessing, and the blessings of the, of the love diamond heart and the calligraphy, all three, instead of being a total of 475, all three are 300. Okay? If you have negativity issues in your life, this is one of the fastest ways to resolve it. That combination, you will not be the same person the next day. I, it, you just will not be the same person the next day. <clears throat> Package two is the bottom two. I shouldn't say the bottom two. Uh, it's the numbers two and three, which is the crown chakra blessing and the, uh, the calligraphy and the diamond heart. That normal combination is 175. I drop it by $25, so you can get both for 150. Okay. So again, I will put the image if that's something of interest to you. We offer lots of free every day. I'm here on live stream, always offering complimentary blessings. But but if you're in a position, or even if you're not in a position, but you know it's something you need, trust you will get so much value out of it, so much mileage that you're going to bounce and that bounce will be a good bounce and you will rec re recoup that that financial output in a very short period of time because those blockages that have been blocking you could be removed certainly enough to replace uh, your your service to self okay so we've covered a lot of distance here today um, I was not able to go into very deep teachings on the nature of negativity, although we did receive a teaching from Kuan Yin, which I believe was sufficient to cover the nature of it. Um, I will go into it a bit more tomorrow, along with the other subjects relating to negativity, which has to do with abandonment issues. Uh, and um, uh, this is obviously a blockage area for me because I have to continually stop and think about it. And um, looking outside of ourselves for approval. That combination, abandonment and looking outside of ourselves for approval, is like we're little meek. We're always looking up for that approval, always worried about somebody leaving us, okay? These are things that keep us in a very negative place, a, a non-positive, service-based place. So I'm going to go into more of that tomorrow, and I'll touch on more of what we talked about today. Um, when I put up that JPEG, it will list these services for the gamut of what comes under negativity, so you'll see other choices besides what we saw today. So congratulations to you, Melina. Congratulations to everybody that came. You all received big blessings with this splash. And please share this video. If you're new, it's your first time, hit the subscribe button uh, on your player. If it's not there now, it'll be when I, when I finish. And uh, that'll let you know when I go live, okay? I'm very grateful uh, beyond measure for, for all of you, because without you here, I cannot serve. So thank you, Divine Tao. Thank you, Source. Thank you, my spiritual father, Master Shah. Thank you, Tim, ITN Divine. Thank you, the countless heavens, generals and soldiers, heavens, animals, all those that came to help uh, Melina and to bless all of us. Thank you, uh, the Tao light ball that came to serve. Love you, love you, love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye, everybody.